College Football Performance Awards. finished the 2010 season with a nation-leading nine interceptions and is a recipient of the 2010 Defensive Back Trophy from College Football Performance Awards. The goal of the College Football Awards is to provide the most scientifically rigorous confirmance in college football. All recipients are selected exclusively based on objective scientific rankings of the extent to which individual players increase the overall effectiveness of their teams. At this time, Assistant Director of the College Football Performance Awards, Dr. Harold Smith, and Head Coach Frank Beamer would like to present J. Ron Hosley with the 2010 Defensive Back Trophy from College Football Performance Awards. Let's give a big, hooky round of applause. Things, you know, uh, speed, you know, um, being coachable, you know, uh, learning, you know, what I learned in the, in the film room and taking and applying it on the field, you know, uh, that's a big part of my game, you know, um, you know, just doing the small things right, you know, um, and, and carrying it out on the field, you know. Oh, it's always, it's always room for improvement, you know. Um, as a player, you never want to get satisfied, you know. Um, just little things, you know, keep working on the little things, you know. Um, as far as my steps, keeping my steps right, you know, my jam, press game, you know, um, working on my back pedal, you know, things like that, just to, you know, refine my game, you know. A lot of time working on your back pedal, you know, working on your brakes, you know, um, just little things, you know, you want to, you know, a lot of people, you know, come in and, you know, try to do too much, you know, it's just, you know, try to pay attention to detail, you know, um, listen to your coaches, you know, your coaches got all the information you need, you know. Um, Get you to the next level, or, you know, to get you better, you know, and uh, watch, watch guys ahead of you. You know, they they they've been through it. You know, they have a lot of experience. You know, that's what I learned from. You know, the guys who've been through it: D. Hall, Brandon Flowers, Macho. You know, uh, that's the guys I watch. Man, uh, it's, it pumps, it pumps the fans up. You know, it pumps me up. You know, um, as a defensive back, you want to have your hands on the ball. You know, you want to, you want those opportunities. And uh, it's not about just, you know. Getting the opportunity is about you know taking advantage and making that play. You know, um, coach always preach he want playmakers. You know, and uh, that's what I want to do. You know, go out there and be be a playmaker. You know, play my game. Coach man, I appreciate everything he's done for me so far. You know, uh, as far as working on my game. You know, being a mentor of the game and you know teaching me the, the film, watching film, and you know just putting me in position to make plays. You know, uh, a good coach makes a good player. You know, and. Uh, you know, he's definitely been on me, you know, gave me the tangibles, you know, things, you know, as far as the film and, you know, the, the techniques that I, you know, learned as I've been here, you know, I thank him for that. You know, each each each, each interception, you know, it, it's, it does something for me, you know, uh, it just, I, I have to say the NC State game is one of the, one of those games that, you know, um, a guy, a cornerback would love to have, you know, and, uh, throughout their career, you know, and uh, it's, it's, been, it's been a good season, you know, um, each interception I cherish, you know, and uh, I want more, you know, and I look forward to the, the future, you know, in next season. We're so proud of J. Ron. Appreciate uh, the award. Uh, the uh, and what's been great is he worked. He's worked exceptionally hard this spring to get even better. So maybe he can win that award back to back. But uh, we do appreciate the award, and I know he does. And he's an exceptional player, exceptional person, and uh, he chose a good guy. He just he's got a knack for the game. He, he's got a knack for playing the football. He's got very, he's got good athletic ability. Uh, in the first game he ever played against Alabama as a true freshman, he's back there returning punts, never flinched, and it, it kind of made a statement that night what kind of player he is. And uh, he just got it. The, the game makes sense to him. Uh, 
he's got ability, but he's got great football sense. Well, you know, we uh, we got a chance to have a good football team. We uh, I told our players here in the meeting a few minutes ago, you know, what progress we make from now till next fall in the weight room, getting ourselves bigger, stronger, faster, great shape, uh, throwing the ball, catching the ball, kicking the ball. You know, how much progress we make as a team between now and then, I think that's going to really be the issue on how good a football team we can be. We get a man up some, so you know, you got to be pretty good if you're going to run with good receivers. And then, uh, you know, we play a lot of man free. We play a lot of different coverages, which I think helps them as far as developing it for the next level, because they've had experience uh, in a lot of different coverages. And then Torian Gray, uh, I think an excellent uh, secondary coach. A uh, guy played here, played in the NFL a while, and understands the game. Uh, you know, he's a smart uh, secondary coach. That's a great teacher. So I, I think that he should get, uh, get some credit. College Football Performance Awards.